So throughout my life, I had my fair share of addictions. Funko Pops, caffeine, liquor, weed. But my most recent addiction are these Pokemon 151 full art cards, bro. Cause the art on these, just look at that. That's the side duck card. Look how beautiful that is. Look at the shadows, look at the contrast. Look at everything with this card. It screams art. This is a Picasso, I like it. And then we also got this Snorlax promo card for the 151 Elite Trainer Box. City in Flames Elite Trainer Box promo card. Just look at that. Look at it, there it is in all its glory. And also that Pikachu one. I saw Chum Lee pull this one in his, one of his TikTok videos when he was at the pawn shop. And once I saw it, I knew I had to have it. And now it's in my possession. So I got a confession to make. I am so fucking mad right now, bro. I can't find no Pokemon 151 packs anywhere. Are you scalpers, bro? I swear to God, count your fucking days. Cause if I catch you in the streets, I'll beat your ass, boy. But anywho, so I just hit up a card shop and here in Vegas, and my best choice, I don't give a fuck if the 151 packs are in Japanese, bro. That's my shit, bro. That's my sauce. I'm gonna go pick some up, and I'm ready to share a little bit of love, a little bit of money, so I can get my hands on those 151 packs, because this shit is pissing me the fuck off, bro. I'm tired of buying single fucking cards on eBay, questioning their fucking authenticity. Is they real? Is they fake? Looks real to me, bro, but I don't know shit because I just started uh, collecting Pokemon cards like what? About a week ago, a week ago, a week ago. So right now, I'm going to get ready. Well, I'm ready right now. I'm wearing my Mario Bros shirt for good luck. You know what I'm saying? We're going to go drive down there to Shanghai Plaza. Say hi, you know, and then we're going to buy some Pokemon cards for the low or for the high. I'm going to fuck. I'm ready to drop money on these hoes. Stay tuned for that. Three hours later. Lord and behold, we just came back from Shanghai Plaza and we secured the bag, motherfuckers. Look at that. The Scarlet and Violet 151 Pokemon packs in Japanese. I don't really care. I heard the Japanese cards are higher quality compared to the English ones. And honestly, bro, I bought nine. I have eight packs right here in my hand because me and my girlfriend got excited and we opened up some in the car as we were still in the parking lot. And check it out. Out of those two packs, we got some great pulls. We got this right here, that Master Ball. We got, I think, we got Gyarados, and we got this one, the full art. And if you guys know, bro, that's the whole reason why I got into collecting these Pokemon cards was because of the artwork of these full art ones, bro. Just look at that. Look at the shininess. Look at the reflectiveness. It is so amazing. I'm so glad we were able to pick these up, bro. And for a steal price, they had some great prices there, too. So, you know, your boy had to pick up 10. We opened up two. So stay tuned because we about to unbox these, bro. We about to unwrap them. Hopefully, we get some great pulls because I heard the pull rates for these Japanese versions are a lot better and a lot higher than the English ones. We're going to put that to the test today in this video. So stay tuned for these unwrapping, unboxing, unsealing of the Pokemon 151 Japanese packs. My heart is pumping. We're about to open the Japanese 151 packs. So let's get started. Got the first one right here. So let's see what other hits we can get. We already got two amazing hits. This card right here. Got this one. Got this one. Okay. Oh, a Diggly. Diggly. That's what she said. Yeah, bro. Okay, so I think that's a hit right there. Whoa, okay, okay. I got it. I got it. I like that one. And we got these two to, end, to top that off. So that was the first pack. We're going to go ahead and open up the next one. This is the next pack. We're going to go ahead and get that bad boy open. Heart is pounding right now because I don't know what the fuck I'm going to hit. So I'm trying to get this open nice and carefully. Don't want to damage any, any potential hits. So, okay. Let's keep going. Ooh, okay, that's cool, that's cool. I think that's a hit. Okay, that was cool too. And then we got these to end that one. Not bad, so far so good. I can't complain, the pull rates on these ones are actually really fucking good. I ain't gonna lie to you. So I'm kind of liking these a lot better than the fucking English version because the English version are fucking, the pull rates are fucking ass, but. That doesn't seem to be the case with these Japanese ones. And they're in Japanese, which in my opinion, I think are a lot cooler looking than the English ones. Cause they're in Japanese, bro. All right, next pack. Yeah, uh, okay, let's keep going. What the fuck? I keep getting these. I don't know if that's the standard for, for uh, Japanese cards, but I keep getting those Master Ball ones, so that's that's pretty cool. I don't even know if they're Master Balls. Like I said, I just recently started collecting Pokemon cards about a week ago, so if I pull something amazing 
and you don't see me like react to it if you see, if you see me react to it like it's lightweight and with no reaction bro it's because i only started collecting these bitches about a week ago so if i pull a good card and you see me have no reaction my bad we're gonna get started and open the next pack but let's keep going psyduck i like psyduck players bro but now i don't have to i fucking pulled it japanese luck is on my fucking side that little fucking cat is blessing me today all right but i gotta get my composure so we're gonna <laughs> don't care and we got giovanni which and 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 the thing that says Giovanni, but we got Giovanni. So so that was an amazing pull. We are doing a fucking phenomenal job. We still got four packs left, so we're gonna keep opening these fucking packs. Hopefully, we keep getting luck. Hopefully, I didn't use up all my luck with this one. Holy shit! If I get a fucking Charizard, I'm a blue. I'm a I'm a fucking go crazy, bro. I'm gonna go insane. But let's keep opening these fucking packs. Wonder. So far, so good. I got that card right there, that Charmander full art card, is one of the cards that I really fucking wanted. I was about to drop money on it. I was about to drop, I think it's $23 right now on TCG Players. Uh, don't take my word for it, but I think that's what it's going for right now. Let's keep going. So, all right. Oh, shit. Blastoise, baby! Blastoise! Holy fucking shit! We are doing amazing with these Japanese 151 packs. Holy shit, it is true what they say. The pull rates are a lot higher than the English version. I don't care if the English version is worth more. The Japanese art and the Japanese text is what draws me to these fucking cards. And we are doing fucking amazing. We don't fake our pulls here. This is 100% legit, unedited, raw director's cut type shit. Three packs left. Can we pull a Charizard? Can we pull it? Let's find out later. Let's find out now, actually. What the fuck? Why did I say later? Let's find out right now. So y'all might be saying, Freddy, why are you biting into them? Why are you trying to eat these cards? I don't know. I don't know. It's just how I open it. All right. Let's keep going. Jigglypuff. Okay. All right. I think that's a pull. Uh, we got to do our research on that one, baby. I don't know what that is. All right. So not bad for that for that pack um i keep getting those like i said i don't know if that's the standard for the japanese packs but um i keep pulling these i don't know if this is the master ball but it, it's something i don't know like i said i started collecting pokemon cards about a week ago these fucking packs were amazing i need to go back and buy some more next pack okay i'm gonna put that in the pile okay and, okay, not too bad there. Like I said, I I pulled this full art card wood. Um, I don't know what it, what what, it, what exactly it is, but it's a full art. Last pack, guys. Can we get some last pack magic with this one? Let's find out. Let's open it. See what we can get. See what we had. What we get our hands on. Before we start going through this pack, let's just take a moment and pray. Dear Jesus, let me pull something real good. Let it be kind. Let it be big. Let it be valuable. Let it be. Hollow, let it be whatever, just let it be good. God is good. Oh, the God. Let's go. I'm sweating buckets, bro. Okay. Diggly. Oh, okay. Going back in there. And the last three cards. All right. Not bad. We got a mine. But that, that was it. I honestly, I, I'm happy with the pull rates that I got. I ain't gonna lie. We got the card I really wanted. One of the cards that I really wanted. We got that one right there. So, like I said, not bad. We're about to sleeve these up. We're about to put these in the fucking safe. These are the type of cards that I like to get home from work, sip on some bourbon, put on some good ass chill music, and just admire the fuck out these cards. And just appreciating that they are in my possession. And I pulled this shit. I didn't have to buy it off of TZG players, which isn't a bad option. Sometimes buying singles is a lot cheaper than pulling them, buying packs and shit. But honestly, I am happy 
with this pull rate. Your boy's back and bigger, literally bigger than ever. And we about to keep doing these Pokemon videos on my channel. If you like that, go ahead and like and subscribe and turn on your notifications so you guys can get notified every time I post a video. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you have yourself a wonderful day.